Hi, welcome to Graphic 45. I'm Janice and I'm here to show you how I made this simple and yet eye-catching pop-up spread. I made this as a sort of introduction page for my art journal. For this project, I used the Ocean Blue collection. So these are the 8x8 papers and the coordinating stickers that go with the collection. I started off with creating the base of my pop-up which is about 7 inches in height and 10 inches in width, but you can adjust the size according to your preference. Once the base is done, I started creating a floating plane at the center of my spread. So I made a parallel fold using some of the excess papers from when I created the base. And this is about an inch thick. And then I left off about a quarter of an inch as my gluing tabs. And I glued that onto my base. I then created parallelograms on each side of my parallel fold and later on I'm going to attach my folding plane on it. I repeated the same steps at the bottom part of my page I then attached a strip of the postal stamps design onto it to serve as a folding plane for that bottom portion. I used one of the stickers and placed it on a piece of paper, that way it doesn't stick to the base. I folded that in half and glued that onto the central parallel fold. At this point, it's just about adding a bit more embellishments. I fuzzy cut some of the seashells and starfishes from the papers and worked my way onto creating my layout. 
I also used in one of the frame pieces from the stickers. That way, if I wanted to add in a photo in the future, I have space to work with it. And yet, the composition I made allows that part to stand on its own, even without any add-on photo. I used in a bit more of the stickers on the sides of my base to lessen the white spaces and also adding in some balance to my composition. Once I was happy with the design, I wanted to provide glimmering effects of crashing waves onto my background. So I used some texture gel and swirled in some metallic blue cream paste. Acrylic paint can also work as an alternative for this one. Then I added in different types of glitter to give it a sparkle. And I'm done! This project isn't only limiting to journaling. You can use it to create cards and pretty much anything you like to apply it to. Thank you for watching and I hope you enjoyed this video. Please do like, comment, and subscribe for more Graphic 45 inspirations. Bye!